Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Journey Beyond the Abyss. Yes, chat on. All right, let's just get started right away. So we have a nice, twisty, beautiful cog dancer. All that's left is to decide how we want to get using it. Making us some machine frames, obviously. So, I believe that we're still not quite done filling this thing just yet, right? Yes, I have a nice supply of obsidian, diamond, but I don't quite have a supply of gold. So what's missing? I've got a decent supply of gold shards. I'm going to need some more. Yeah, you're going to need some more. Yeah, well, there's, there's gold, there's iron, okay. So what's holding them up? There's bone. Okay, it needs flint. But it also clearly needs stone. We have stone. Ah, we need more wood loaded up in there. So we need to load it up with more wood. Hello, Ian. Welcome to the stream. I was just determining uh, what the cog dancer needed to load us up some more resources so that we can get building. So we're going to need some more wood. And we're going to need some more uh, flint, it's looking like. Well, honestly, I think the fastest way I've found to get sticks right now is just to cut down another tree. Yeah, we need to do that anyway. We need to do that anyway just to get some more wood in storage. So, where's my bone meal? There we are. And just lay these out. This will get us a ton of sticks just in raw form, but we'll also have the sawmill loaded up, of course. And uh, where's my bag? There's my bag. Switch us over to Lumber Axe. Where is Lumber Axe? There is Lumber Axe. Yes. Here we go. So, shouldn't I have two crates on me? Where's my second one? You know, let's just throw out that cobblestone. It's fine. Let me go inside and look for my second bag real quick. Or box. Did I set it down, like, somewhere on the platform? It's fine. We'll, we'll just pick up a second one. Those aren't exactly hard to make. Ah, no, it's inside the backpack. That's okay. So, put these in my hand just to repair them. And suffer through a lag spike. Suffer through a real bad lag spike. Yeah, I definitely need to buy myself some more RAM, I think. Need to go download it, obviously. Mm-hmm. Right, and that's a problem. Are you out of sawmill? You are out of saw. Oh, boy. And that is unfortunately one we don't have a dancer for just yet. But that's why we're looking into alternate sources for sticks just at the moment. Yes, it's dropping tons of them. Beautiful. Get out of here. All those sticks. Let's also set ourselves off of capitalism mode just to save us inventory slots. And with this lovely pile of wood, we'll probably turn most of this into log piles just to compact it. 
But we'll start processing more and more of it down into the lower levels of uh, sawmill products. Just because we need tons of sticks right now. Oops, not that one. The bag of holding is reserved for more uh, tool-like objects. Yes, I might also want to get myself a second one of those backpacks. At least once we... Oh. Pardon me. Phone is... Phone is... All right, I'm sorry about that. They just had a wrong number. Don't you love it when that happens? All right, all right. Or at least I presume so, because they very rudely hung up in my face as soon as I answered. Most of that time was just me fumbling with my phone. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, they're another relentless one. And I'm fairly certain that most of them are a scam, too, because they're calling you, like, this new government program, this new thing, this new blah, blah, blah. And, and it's like, no, that's that's not real. You're just saying that to get me interested. No. Your car warranty. Yeah, no, that thing ain't been under warranty for, like, 20 years. That thing's warranty expired when my dad still owned it. Come on. Okay, and technically we have enough saplings already. And that's wonderful news, isn't it? Okay, with a stack of sticks, that's enough for the moment. Let's just pick up more as, when, as and when we pass by. And compact most of these down into log piles, use some of them. Just a big pile of them. And... Huzzah! And that should translate into quite a lot of charcoal. The rest of it, just the, the change, we'll hold on to and we'll eventually process down. Like, if I were to process that all into sticks, that would be a lot of sticks. <sighs> Mass simply can't keep up with how fast we move our inventory around. We're outrunning the laws of physics. And yes, we are going to want to start keeping every bit of ash that we produce. Because at one point we're going to want to mass automate the construction of crafting tables. Simply to make it easier to build all the artisan tables we're going to need for mass automation. Because, um... The mod for the mod for automating the artisan tables is artisan automation, and this thing, the thing you need most of it is these artisanal power converters. These are not just power input; these are also inventory input. And you see, these also need mechanical artisans to make. Well, to make mechanical artisans, 
you don't need a whole lot. You need these copper coil blocks, so you're going to need to automate wire production for them, but you need basic workshops for each and every one. So, for the tons and tons of these artisanal power converters, you're going to want to automate your basic workshops. And that's just something we're going to have to do at one point. And that means that we need to, to automate all the associated parts of that. That means creating automated refractory clay, creating automated... Um, creating automated all the parts of furnaces, all the parts of... Y you get it. It's going to be a little bit. And we won't be doing that for a little while yet. At the very least, we need to... Well, we're working on the parts for a cobble gen right now. Right now, right now. Oh, goodness. The stash is full. Well, that means time to make more steel. Just to empty it out. Oh, boy. We're going to need more iron soon. We're going to need more... And just chunk it all in there. Yeah, it's a good feeling when you're crafting masses of steel simply to clear out your storage space. That's a that's a low key brag right there. All right. How is our shower of sticks doing? Excellent. Hello, Blood Devon. Welcome to a somewhat sleepy early morning stream. Mm, I'm feeling a little bit under the weather, so forgive me if I don't sound enthusiastic. Alright. We're just gathering up sticks to get the cog dancer dancing some more. Okay, that should be enough for it to make 32 gears and some change. Now it's just gonna need more boards. Oh boy, it is gonna need a lot more boards. So it's time to make a new saw blade, unfortunately. And we don't have a dancer for it, but that's life. At least it's only a single saw blade. Where is my diorite? There it is. Yeah, I don't have an easy source for auto mining diorite. Not just yet, I don't think. Am I keeping... Oh boy, am I completely out of flint? Yeah, I fed it all to the dancer. Well, time to go some and uh, farm some more flint. Just dig some up. That's fine. Oh, I do? <laughs> yeah, I suppose I do. Hmm. Do you mean in terms of sound quality, or do you mean more in terms of my enthusiasm? <laughs> okay, let's take our extractor out. And let's also put that bone meal away. Over in here. Why am I carrying tinder? I was going to place that out on the platform, I guess. It's fine. Now let's also completely repair our arrows. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. <sighs> Some days you just don't have the energy in you to uh, to fully express yourself. That's okay. Yeah, let's just chunk this all down. There we go. There we go. And that should be enough for us to set up some inventory filters by now. 
Yeah. So. Uh, you know, I could feed these to the to the dancer. So, just get rid of granite, get rid of andesite. So, we want mostly flint. But let's also get a little bit of this and a little bit of that. And yeah, maybe a little bit more of that. There we go. And, yeah, just a little bit more. Yep, look at all that gravel. Isn't the ocean floor a wonderful bounty? Look at all that hypothermia. Isn't the ocean floor a wonderful bounty? And we're going to ignore like 90% of all it drops, so the ocean floor is just going to be littered for a little while. That's okay. We're just being a good industrialist. Old school filters, yep. I could probably do a little bit better. Why is an Enderman angry at us? Oh well. But yeah, I, I could probably get like a... I, maybe I could get a backpack? Can I? Are there? Yeah, maybe I could get one of these mining backpacks from Forestry. And that would suck things automatically into it. But... Eh... I don't know how well that would work for us. Okay. Are we out of scabby boy already? We might just be. Eat some delicious life-giving tripes. Yep. That Enderman is free to feel as angry as he likes. He can just express itself. It's primal scream therapy. We don't care. Just so long as he goes away by the time we're back to base, which he should. Okay, is that everything picked up? I do believe that it do. Mm, not quite. I see a little bit more flint around. And yes, we're just going to ignore the fact that we're slowly freezing to death simply because the health drain is so slow that we can offset it completely. Yes, the real limit now is that we ran out of excavator. Where is... You know what, let's just go up to the surface. I can't tell where the moon pool is compared to just all the other things that are breaking up the... the underwater sections of the base. Okay. No, I would... I would have liked to get more flint than this, but it's fine. Okay. Da, 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 da. So we'll throw that into the dancer. We'll chunk this... Well, we need to chunk it all up into shards. Yeah, let's just keep a little bit of flint, just in case we need it in the future. But the rest of it, the rest of it is going either into the dancer or onto this new sawmill blade. Uh, you might, you probably heard me getting hurt by water, if anything. Okay, and now it's down to Boone. Which we do have some of that. Okay, and now, if I recall, it should be four of these. And four of... Did I get any more? Yeah, I did. Goodness, we got a lot of ingot support out. That's excellent news. Speaking of, our steel should be done mixing by now. Alright. Uh, yep. So, how do I want the steel? Um, I have a goodly supply of ingots. I have enough mechanical compartments. 
mechanical components. So let's pour out some blocks. Goodness, that auto repair is slow. All right, all right, all right. So now up into iron, up into gold. And we'll stop at diamond because it gives better efficiency than obsidian in my opinion. So just complete a quick sawmill dance. Yep, it's not so painful when you're only doing one. And you know, let's clear out the logs. Let's just not do logs right now. We want it to get down to boards. And get us down to boards, please. Just a couple stacks. Yep, that is a saw blade. That's what we needed right now because the old one broke. And we need boards for the cog dancer. Okay. Yep, you're almost done. Yep, we need sticks, compressed sticks, and flint shards for the cog dancer in order to uh, unlock its potential again. Let's also... Do I have any block of gold left? Let's chunk up a few of those. Just because I think it was a bit low on gold shards. Okay, you're done. Hmm? Drying rack? What about it? I don't have anything on either of my drying racks. I'm not sure what you're talking about, Devin. Gonna need more tripes. Hmm. What's the pump jack on right now? It's on silver, right? Yeah, and I don't have any silver stored up. Well, let's let's run the generator for just a second. Just to actually wait. No. Yeah, I, I want to do something for the tanks before I run the generator. Because the pipe is overloaded right now. Need to put proper uh, filtration on that. Or uh, proper uh, liquid overflow protection, I should say. Okay, so way up here at the top. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't particularly matter. Did I put away all my sticks? I did. I put them all into the stupid. Oh, well. So there's stone... Which one of these is stone? This one. And this is our flint. Get those crafting. And as soon as we have some more wood blades, that'll get it going. There's iron. How's that doing? That's doing fine. And yeah, feed it a little bit more gold just to keep it supplied. But the thing we need right now is those compressed sticks. We can get a few of them going by now, I imagine. And also, let's see if I have any... I, I should have a few void pipes left. Which is what I need right now. Yeah, a few of them. As well as some pipe sealant. I can get that from cactus green and gasoline. I have a little bit of gasoline in the tank. Cool. Let's just chunk down some cacti. I could also use slime, and slime is free, but eh. This is faster at the moment. And yes, I know I could clip the cactus one level up, but I find that with my luck... Yeah, I'm just going to avoid the overflow for the moment. 
I'll, I'll show you what I'm gonna do. Yeah, I, I find that if I clip my cactus on the second level, it inevitably, everything just falls down immediately on the cactus. So, we don't do that. It's fine. We don't harvest the cactus very often. How goes the coal? Eh, it's time to cycle it, but our coal storage is damn near full, and I just had to empty it out by making a bunch of steel, so we don't need to cycle charcoal right now. Okay. Make us some of these. And I'm going to need gasoline for this, aren't I? Yep. Well, we've got a little bit in storage. And there we go. Some fluid pipes. Let's just keep our pipe sealant over here. Yeah. I already had some. It's fine. Yep. Oh, also, I am going to need clay pipes. Do I have any glass whatsoever? Yes. Do I have any clay whatsoever? Yes. With any sealant whatsoever? Yes. And we just dupe. Dupe. Clay pipes will prioritize input over all else. If there is a valid storage system for them to input into, they will ensure that it gets fed before the liquid or items go to another pipe. So, we want those feeding into our tanks so that the fluid, the void pipes, do not take half of the output at all times. We just want them to take all of the output when there is no other destination. And in this way, if we switch it over to input with a clay pipe and then just I guess it'll have to be on the downside overflow into a fluid pipe now yep you see now wait what why is that one full that's diesel this pipe isn't full of diesel is it eh, maybe it's just a visual glitch Careful not to kill our tank. And then down into there. Yeah, it should be full of gasoline right now. Hmm. Weird. Yep. And the eventual goal is, once I have Buildcraft gates, put gates on these reading all the tanks, and just shut off the distillery when all three tanks are full. That way, it'll run a little bit extra. It'll run until, um... It'll run essentially until all three tanks are full, so... Like, as soon as gasoline and diesel fill up, it'll be running just filling up lubricant and wasting the rest. But that is only a little bit of waste, compared to running it 24-7 and wasting everything all of the time. Hypothermia, you are a problem. So, we can run our diesel gen, and now the pipe will start filling up once more. Oh, also, we need to do something about this. Yeah, we do. Um, in the meantime, let's empty it out, but... Uh-huh. Those pipes clear out fast once you clear the blockage, don't they? And they immediately fill up again, too. Oh, boy. I think buildcraft pipes might not be fast enough. Hmm. Might not be fast enough to deal with this. Yeah, also part of the problem is that it's been clogged up for so long that it's like sloshing back and forth and suddenly filling it up choked it. Oh, also, do I need to get proper filtration down all three lines? I possibly do. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, so lubricant goes that way. Gasoline 
goes down yellow side. Can I just put it immediately? Yeah. Okay, gasoline and diesel goes down yellow side. Okay, and now I just need to tell it that diesel goes down yellow side. Okay, it's completely explicitly filtered now, so it should be moving about as fast as it can. What are you outputting? You are outputting nothing. Why are you outputting nothing? Okay. Pipe is loaded with diesel right now, right? Is it just slow? Yeah, why is it draining the gas? Oh, it's draining the gas because that lever is on. Shoot. And that outputs it into a clay pipe? That shouldn't happen. That should not happen at all. Hmm. Well, this thing cannot be run by lever control. It has to be run by redstone engine control. So take off this pipe that I was using just to fill barrels. And we'll need to run that off of a wood diamond pipe with a redstone engine sooner or later. Yeah, and in fact, that also means that this needs to be running off of a Billcraft pipe too. Yeah, that's wasting diesel. Oh boy. Okay, so now what is the problem? Diesel, gasoline, lubricant down red. You should just be draining out now. Yeah, you should be. So now, it's just filling up with diesel. Cool. Okay, cool. So, we need to get some more wood diamond fluid pipes. And some more gold fluid pipes. And we need to run this thing entirely on Buildcraft. Because it did not like being... Uh, it did... Uh, apparently it can just output into clay pipes when it's running off of Buildcraft's red uh, when it's running off of IE's fluid controls. It's a good thing we found out right away. So we need two of these, all of these that we can carry. And that's it for now. Ah, good, we can start clearing all this out. Uh, yep, it's fine. It's it's just like five hundred buckets of it. That's that's not much. <laughs> Seriously though, we'll run we'll run the engine for a few minutes and it'll it'll all be back. It wasted a little bit, but not a disastrous amount. We we didn't like leave that running all night long or something. We didn't exhaust the entire line. I thought I had more pipe sealant than that. Okay, so... We're gonna need two pistons... Just for the redstone engines. And that's gonna be a little bit of cobble. A little bit of plank. A little bit of glass. So, make piston. Come on. Come on, game. Work with me, please. Oh, shoot. It needs to be switched back to lava. Well. It's okay. This is also why we need the Cog Dancer, so we can build that second engineering station really easily. But, it's fine. It's fine for the moment. Okay, so, do, 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 and we're going to need one, two, three, four of those. Keep the rest of the sticks for the Cog Dancer. Load up the rest of the sticks for the Cog Dancer. As well as a couple of stacks of 
these turned into these. And that should keep it running for a good long time, in fact. So, next we need... I think it goes like piston, glass, gears, and planks. Just like so. Sticks for the cog dancer, yes. Sticks for the stick god. Cogs for the cog throne. And da, 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 da. next we are gonna need some more gold ingots than that. And probably all of our remaining glass. Yeah, I need to you know, I need to move the excavator onto silt and just build up a ton of sand from it and smelt a ton of glass. That's probably what I need to do in the end. Either or, it doesn't care. The cog dancer cares not what you call it. It simply does what it does. Seriously, is that all the pipe sealant I made? Okay. We'll make some more. We have some spare slime. Just make a ton. That's clearly the answer. And there we go. And that should hopefully be sufficient. And da, da, da. Hmm. I wonder why it split up into two stacks there. Oh well. Oh well. Oh, also need levers or redstone blocks. Probably redstone blocks. Cheaper. Yes, redstone blocks are cheaper than levers in this pack. Funny how that works, isn't it? Okay, so first of all, just a quick pipe sticking off the back of the gasoline, if the game will stop lagging. Hello, game. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you, game. There you go. There you go. Just a quick pipe sticking off the back here, just for the sake of uh, getting gasoline out. And just an engine right down there, kind of unobtrusive out of sight. As much as possible. And down here, we need to replace this old system for the hot new sexiness. And once more, let's just kind of get under it. Down there. And dupe. Okay, and that should finally be the base maintenance done for now. Why are you not? Ah, there it goes. It just needs a moment. I forget that these are redstone engines and not pipe pulsers. They need a moment to warm up. Okay, so now this should be completely empty. And if I run the diesel engine, it should be completely filling all these up without any unusual drain to any of it. The diesel will be draining a bit just while the pipe pressurizes and obviously while the engine is running. But gasoline should just be filling up, lubricant should just be filling up, and diesel should eventually be filling up just as soon as it's done. Yeah. Yeah, the buildcraft pipes are a bit too slow to fill out, to uh, empty out the 
Well, no, okay. Okay, it's, it's faster. It's just that it only does one at a time. So it needs to cycle through all three, and unfortunately gasoline produces way fast. Keep it daytime. But then as soon as it's down to there, we should see it empties out lubricant. And yeah, it's building up fast because now it's building up gasoline and diesel. What's it doing now? Oh, it's emptying out the pipe. There's the problem. It needs to empty out the pipe. Hmm. Maybe if I immediately, like, split it off on a diamond here and then had three layers of pipe going to each of the three of them. But I think that would have to wait until I have just a ton of glass to make a ton of pipes. As well as having a dedicated crafter. This is good enough for the moment, you know? This is good enough. Oh. Crude oils, though. Hmm. Well, I guess that's an indication that it is, in fact, going fast enough if it's if it's cooking all of our crude oil. Yeah, we need more pipes. But there, now it's filling up gas. And next it'll fill up diesel. And it's working fine enough. It's working fine enough. It's just barely keeping up, I guess. Okay. Well, I just wanted to run that for a minute. Just to, uh... Just in order to, um... Build up a little bit of silver over here. Just so that we had some in case we wanted to make some electrum. Yeah, that's probably good enough. And in fact, I probably want to move that over to... Was it here? Yeah, I probably want to move it over to here just to build up some aluminum. In any case, let's get the cog dancer dancing. Let us, this beautiful tornado of crafting, get it, get it a twistin'. Because we need those gold gears. And unfortunately, the gold gears are the last to fully pressurize. Okay, so that should be wood. This should be compressed sticks, right? Yeah, those are empty. Whereas these are still full of nothing as well. Okay. It's fine. Yep, there it goes. Now it's creating wood gears, and that'll go down the line. And that should eventually fill up with gold gears. Yeah, we do need just more. We need just plain more. But at this point, I'm kind of putting it off for the sake that I want to get a cobble gen going. The sooner we get a cobble gen going, the sooner we can start building it up. Building up cobble to build the platform. To build the rest of the infrastructure. I mean, it's kind of a situation right now where building more infrastructure is maybe... Building more pump jacks is maybe not the best move because we don't have the power system for it. And building more power system is maybe not the best move because we are so close to being able to automate... Like... Automate the system to make more infrastructure. But building the system to make more infrastructure, we need the platform. And building more platform... It's kind of like... We're at a point where there is no choice but to grind, as it was. Yeah, let's turn that off for the moment. No, keep it on, turn the engine off, yeah. Just turn the engine off at the moment. Shoot. We fell into the Utilidor. Oh, boy. Okay. Is there an easy way out anywhere? Eh. Yeah, that's not OSHA safe. Hi, Fluttershy. Uh, glad to see you here in the fuel refinery. The NPCs wandering around so bizarre. Yep. 
I do think that we are producing more diesel than we're burning. How many how many diesel generators can a single refinery run? Does anyone know? I think it can run at least two. Okay, so what am I gonna need in order to make some nano machine? What am I gonna need in order to make some machine frames now that we have cogs? Um, okay, so nano machine frames are the first part of it. And we're just gonna need, we're gonna need a sawmill blade. At least the sawmill blade is relatively, when it's just one. We're gonna need a lot of pig iron, so we're gonna need to visit the blood bank. Is this system pressurized just yet? Yeah, it's getting there. Okay, so we're gonna need four of those gold gears. Four of those diamond gears. Hello, 12th Century Fox. We just, uh, we finally got the Cog Dancer going again after a bunch of derp. Mm. And let's see here. Yeah, we're going to need a little bit of aluminum brass. I don't have any aluminum. Yep, we're going to need to move the pump jack. We are going to need to move the pump jack, and there's just, that's just what we're going to have to do right now. I guess in the meantime, I can, I can keep my pipes in here. And I'm just going to need to take one of these. Yep. Let's also repair the excavator. That's why I haven't put it away, because I need to remind myself that I need that needs repair. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Now let's keep the pipe on hand. And doop doop. There we go. Uh, it wasn't so much cog reloading difficulties as we discovered that there was uh, yet more work to be done on the fuel refinery and that distracted us for a little while. And the fact that I'm tired and feeling a bit sick and a bit derp. Okay. Da, 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 da. So I'm moving a bit slow in general today. Okay. So I need to move... We need to move the dang... Let's get the HV cables while we're here. Let's also... Need to get a new set of tripes. Where are they? Oh, last set of tripes. Sweet. Need to visit the store. Eh, it's fine. I think I just didn't get enough sleep. Okay. Da, 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 da. What was I doing? What was I doing? I was getting ready to move the pump jack, so I need the HV cables. And eh, need those. Need those. Need more connectors, which needs more aluminum. Shoot. Okay. Do I have any K any aluminum whatsoever? That's tin. Um. Okay, we might need to visit a ship just to get a little bit more aluminum. I think the most convenient ship that wouldn't have any anything in it is um would be these ones near spawn. Yeah. They should still have the ore piles in them and the ore piles is where we get the uh get the aluminum from in these. Come on. There. Yep. There we go. Ah, shoot. Did I not light these up? Well, I seem to have gotten away with it anyway. Somehow. F7 mode. Yep. I guess we just, because we teleported in, the monsters had no time to spawn before we were too close. That's neat. Okay. 
Okay, get out Mr. Hammer. Because we don't want to silk touch these. And there should be some aluminum somewhere in here. Get on there. Yep. Here it is. I see the bauxite right there. Yep. If not, we just have our pipes. We, we're just keeping our pipe in our hand, walking around with it out in public and everything. Probably going to get myself arrested. Shouldn't be allowed to carry your pipes out in public. Maybe we're living in a very libertine society. They support our decision. Yeah, you're right. Technically, everything's legal when there's no cops around. Yep, sweet, tasty, wonderful aluminum. It's what a growing base needs. People always look out for that dietary iron, but... Uh, you need a bit more variety in your diet to get a fully balanced, uh, balanced base. Okay. And that's just a little bit of aluminum, but we need just a little bit of aluminum. Oh, that's always a, that's always a rude thing that the Normans say, isn't it? I'm talking to God, not you. I didn't speak to you at all. Just just calm your tits, Frenchie. Okay, so that's unknown. We haven't put that away. The rest of it, just start chunking it into our system. Yep, yep. Well, hating the IRS... That isn't, uh, well, that isn't a German thing, then. That's, that's, I think IRS is explicitly American, but hating the tax collector is a universal experience. That's just, that goes beyond nations. That's a basic human fact, I think. Hell, not even human. That's a basic sentient thing, I think. Platinum. Can I melt these? Yeah, I can melt platinum more. Speaking of, on reflection, um, platinum is another type of vein that immersive engineering can spawn, and I did not find any yet. So there might be more core drilling to do, at least if I want to start gathering all the resources. Yeah, sure, let's keep a few factory blocks for decorative purposes, just in case. Ah, oh, shoot. Did I? Yes, I did. So, what are you? You are blocks. Get on there. Yep, yeah, we all hate the tax man. Well, good thing that wasn't running. Oof. Okay, so that's a little bit of that, just to make a couple of uh, HV adapters. Just make me some. There, that's good enough. Ah, shoot, we need to put this back on lava again. At least we emptied out all the diesel this time. I guess also, Certus Quartz, lovely. That isn't where the service course is going because it's unknown. Hmm. And I think it's just like this and like this, right? Yeah, right. 
Okay, that's a few more connectors. That's enough to expand the base. All right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Both are supposedly identical, but uh, we just aren't defying them hard enough, I'm sure. The only things we can count on for now, like I said, defy harder. We can resist. Yeah, it's wasting a little bit of liquid. It's fine. Yeah. Ultimately, we need more pump jacks, just not right now, you know? Not right now. Right now, we just need a bunch more aluminum. So, we just need to move this temporarily. We will keep the power system in place, at least. Mostly in place. We'll keep this connector here, showing where it, where it goes. I know. It's a tiny amount of waste of a tiny amount of fluid. It's fine. At least we still have hard infrastructure laid in the form of the utilidor being dug and the cable being laid out to here. Eh, let's leave that pipe too. Okay, pack that up just for the sake of neatness. And... Box it up. Over to our aluminum vein. Yep, here we go. And unbox it once more. So, huh, I have Utilidor right here. So, yeah, pump jack like right here probably works. So, da -da -da -da, where's my manual? because I don't quite have a pump jack memorized just yet. I haven't built it enough times to fully engrave it upon my soul. So, light, square of scaffolding. And then it's probably going to need some of those fluid pipes. Two, three, four. Followed by the last three. I do remember some of it at least. And then it's going to need, on the second level, light redstone heavy. Light. Redstone, heavy, leading up to those, okay, da, 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 da. two and those, what the heck? the heck is going on here? I can surround a pipe in scaffolding? What the heck? That was bizarre. Yeah, that's my that's my reaction exactly. What? You behave yourself, system. Okay, and there. Yeah, it snugly fits. And that should do it. Take out the hammer. 
Yep, there we go. There we go. Now. Uh, where is the power input on this thing? Over on this side. Excellent. So. Yeah, just digging down a single space should show me that my utilidor is right there. So, if I do that, then give it a whack. Now, 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 the most dangerous part. Okay, so, I think that in order, because I'm crossing the length of the walking part of the hallway, I want this as high up as possible, so... Let's take our wire cutters. I said, let's take our wire cutters and snip on this one. And now return this to operation. But relay from here and here and then there. So, can I at least sneak under that? Yeah. Oh boy, but I think that if I was just walking at full speed, no, it's fine. As long as I'm not jumping, it's fine. So long as I stick to this side. Okay, okay, good. No jumping in the utilidor. And we'll be fine. Yeah, mind the gap. Okay, now we need a few more pipes to build the system out. Those tunnels are indeed going to get just a little deathy, but that is why we are keeping them as tunnels so that the surface does not become deathy. You know what, we can keep our HV cables in our bag. Yep. Okay, so I should have, yeah, I have some fluid pipes in stock. There we go. Indeed. So, da, 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 da. move this on over. Okay, so we need these just out into here. That's probably good enough. One, get out of my face, grass. Ugh, away with you, nature. No one has died to them yet? Uh, if you watch Riley's playthrough, he supposedly died to them a bunch. Five, six, seven. But yes, I've managed not to die to them yet. I've gotten close a couple of times, but I've not died to them yet. If just barely. Do I have more in here? Yeah. Oh, wait. This is the wrong one. There we go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And... I need a chest. All right, I'll see you around, D Ian. Uh, thank you for stopping by. I'm always happy to see you here. Okay, da, da, da. am I out of chests? Am I just carrying them in my bag or something? Yeah, I am. Ugh, we've almost filled the bag of holding just with random garbage. Ok, 
Okay, can I get onto the side of it? No. Nah. Okay, easy solution. There we go. For those who don't plan ahead. Yep. Ultimately, we need more bags is the answer there, I suppose. We... <laughs> You have one word too many. We need more. That That is the philosophy here. We need more. Yes. Okay, and now if I kick the generator on, we should start outputting just a lot of aluminum. And with that, we should pretty much never need to raid a ship ever again. Because we have silver, we have aluminum, we have copper, and all the rest we can get from excavators. So, between building more infrastructure and moving our current infrastructure around, we have all the resources we need on hand. Yeah. On the other hand, there is inversely too much. Like, our storage on our crusher is clogged right now with the copious amounts of redstone and glowstone so we need to build storage for it it isn't piracy there's no one living there there's undead and creepers I suppose it's piracy against the creepers maybe but piracy against just creepers isn't quite as fun okay so so, 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 since, since we have the cogs done, now we can just pick up some aluminum. Yep, we already have stacks of it. And we can make some aluminum brass. Yes, yeah, so we have too little industry is, uh, that is our problem right now. So, brass, aluminum brass. The alloy ratio on that is one to three. So if I get just 30 of these, 10 of these, make sure all levers are off. Well, you know, I had a rudder installed in my pants, and it's driving me nuts, yar! Har, har, har. Hmm. You know, Talk Like a Pirate Day is coming up soon. That's September 13th, I think, right? Hmm. Yeah, block lever. Thank you. Thankfully, it didn't, uh, it didn't punish me for it. Okay, so next up, we are going to need to go and empty out the blood bank real quick. For, for the sake of some pig iron. Yeah, yeah. Just, uh, they sound like they're doing fine in there. They sound like they're happy with their job. Could you have a better working condition? Mm. You just need to sit in a nice warm bath all day. You're doing good for the world. I'm sure they're fine. Marked levers? That sounds interesting. Like... Could you, were they like built-in signs that you could customize or anything like that? Yeah, they're doing fine. Okay. 
I don't think I want to drain out all 200 ingots worth of this. Let's just drain out 50. So I'm going to need 50 iron and 25 clay. If I can just derp my way into it. So get that going. Right. Also need to empty that out. I think I'm remembering the ratio correctly. I think so. Okay, we can shut this off while we're mixing new stuff. Ah. Well, I mean, levers are kind of marked off and on, but yeah, I guess maybe it needs to be a little bit more obvious for derps like me. Okay, so that's... Hmm, did I not give it enough clay? I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. Ah, yes. Okay, it's a hundred. It's a hundred blood and fifty clay. Or a hundred iron and fifty clay. Right, right, right. I was misremembering the ratio by half. But yeah, I, I, I was being a bit overly ambitious grabbing all four of the uh, tasty piggy pink, I know, yes. It even has a little pig face on it if you look very closely. See the eyes and the nostrils? Little pig block. Yes, there's a reason why tools made out of pig iron have the tasty modifier and the baconlicious. In any case, I just need to get the four blocks cast out and all the rest can be ingots. Mm-hmm. And I mean, have you seen the ingots themselves? Look at that. Oink, indeed. One more block, and that should be done. Right, we, we can also get these out of here. And there. And okay, okay, okay. That is our four blocks of pig iron. The rest, we can just turn all of this into ingots. So there's our aluminum brass, there's our piggy iron blocks, there's our piggy iron ingots, also a little bit of steel, and of course all the cogs. And that should make nano machine frames out of these. Ah, the saw. The saw. Forgot the saw. Well, that's a relatively fast fix. Let's just chunk all that back in there. Let's just dupe. And... 
deep. And saw blade. Next. It's just down to flint, right? Right, right. And I did save a little flint. Next, it'll need to be iron. No, it'll need to be bone next. And I did not save... I have a little bit in stock. It's fine. And... Next, it'll be iron, and that's an unusual one, I think. Yes, because this one uses ingots. And we need to chunk up a little bit more gold. And a little bit more diamond. Not quite that much. Yeah, a saw tower is eventually on the menu, but not quite yet. The saw tower will be on the menu for when we fully automate this process, and that won't be until we have some uh, artisanal automation going to better, to better, um... I do not know the reference. Oh, oh wait, saw, yes, I, I do know the reference. <laughs> yes. You wanna play a game? Yes, I get it, I get it. All right, right, right. Need to chunk those up. And now, finally, do a 360. And do a quick saw dance. I have seen the films just forever ago. I forgot the obsidian. I don't have any obsidian, do I? It wouldn't be JPTA if we didn't have to derp and go all over the place. Yes, to the MC. Okay, let's just get a few. Just dig a hole straight on down. It's fine. Get just like a stack or so. Turn it all into shards just to have them. Good enough. Right. Can only drink source. And... Back we go once more. A very quick abyss trip. And yet a dehydrating one. Really is weird how that works. All right. And we've completed the saw dance. One more time. Nano machine frames. It would, I would say we have easier nano machine frames, but uh, our own idiocy gets in our way. Thankfully, I think we've mostly dealt with that for future crafts. And now, look at all that pig. Yes. Now we need to use these in order to make proper machine frames. So that's just going to take. A lot of iron. Oh boy. It's gonna take a lot of iron. Um, we don't have a lot of iron blocks at the moment. 
That could be another Abyss trip, but you know what? I think I'm just going to clear out our ship. Yeah, we'll do one last ship raid. Huzzah! Except... Okay, obviously, I've been tired and derped today. Yeah, we have a lot of iron. It's just an ingot form, and you can't quickly make blocks. The only way to make blocks is to cast it. Melt and cast it. And honestly, for the... In the context of making of making these machine frames, where it's going to take 12 blocks each time, we don't have a lot of iron. So we need to go and get some more. But I am out of time for the day. I'm sorry the stream was kind of short and kind of derp. The good news is we've done a lot of debugging today. That uh, we fixed all our... We fixed some problems with our fuel refinery... We fixed some supply issues with our cog dancer, and we have the nano machine frames. So let's keep those here, I suppose. Yeah, we'll consider that an intermediary. Yep, yep. So we're almost on the way. And I think that one craft of nano machine frames, that should be enough. Because, yeah, I'm going to want to make three block breakers. So I'm going to need three crafts of these machine frames, I think, because each one of these takes three of those spike traps and each one takes one. So yes, you need to craft that three times, and that should give me enough for another engineer's workbench, shouldn't I? So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we're on the path to having our block breakers. We're on the path to having a spare engineer's workbench so that we don't need to choose between gasoline and lava anymore. That's wonderful news. So, next time on Journey Beyond the Abyss, we'll do the final bit of piracy. We'll get the iron we need to make those machine frames. And we'll hopefully get the cobble gen going. Until then, thank you everyone for joining me. 12th Century Fox, Blood Devon, it's always lovely to have you here. Everyone else watching, have yourself a beautiful day. Have yourself a lovely evening. I will see you next time.